Not going to really get rid of the warm weather even this weekend, despite a cold front coming our way late tonight. It's going to be a weak cold front, not providing us a cool down this weekend, but lower humidity is on the way. So right now temperatures are in the 70s across the area. We're dealing with mostly cloudy skies, a little bit of sunshine and blue sky trying to poke through, but we'll keep the cloud cover around the rest of today with temperatures staying in the 70s throughout the afternoon. Here's a look at our cold front that it's making its way to the deep south. It will be here late tonight but it's really not going to bring us much rain and it's not going to bring us a big cool down. Not much, moist, not much moisture is out ahead of this cold front. So I think as we head throughout your Thursday and into early tomorrow, we will trend mostly dry, but here's a look at what's to come. Expect mostly cloudy skies, some breaks at times this afternoon. Maybe we'll see a couple stray showers this evening before the front arrives. Not really expecting much, probably no measurable rain, just a couple little spotty light showers possible. Very low chance for that tonight and during the overnight hours. Here comes the front overnight, so tomorrow morning we'll still be dealing with mostly cloudy skies, but clouds will be on their way out tomorrow as winds turn mostly from the north and northwest, clearing the cloud cover and bringing us lots of sunshine by later tomorrow morning. And we stay sunny the second half of Friday and less humid and sunny all weekend. So as for today, it's going to be warm, a little humid temperatures reaching the mid 70s this afternoon, mostly dry weather expected, maybe a spot shower this evening. Temperatures will be mild in the 60s tonight and 60s through early tomorrow morning. And tomorrow we're still going to be back into the lower 70s. So that's really all the cold front is doing is dropping our temperature a couple degrees by tomorrow afternoon. We'll see decreasing clouds, less humidity funneling in and breezy conditions again tomorrow. So it's breezy today, but today our winds are coming most mostly from the south and southwest and tomorrow behind the front. Our winds will be breezy, but coming mostly from the north and northwest, giving us that more refreshing feel with temperatures in the lower 70s tomorrow afternoon and this weekend. Much of the same plenty of sunshine Saturday and Sunday warm in the afternoons in the lower 70s both both days, but with the drier air around behind the front, our nights and mornings this weekend will be actually kind of chilly. We'll be dropping to the 40s on the North Shore and 50s on the South Shore, so we'll have kind of cool, refreshing nights and mornings this weekend as the front brings us that drier air mass and we'll have those lower dew points around starting tomorrow through Saturday and Sunday, so less humid, more comfortable this weekend still kind of warm and spring like and the next week our pattern changes again. We get an even bigger warm up next week with winds coming mostly from the south starting Monday that will increase our dew points and our moisture, so we'll feel more muggy starting next week with temperatures starting to soar back to the upper 70s. So this weekend not so warm and definitely not humid, so beautiful weather this weekend and then we get into the lower 70s tomorrow through Saturday and Sunday and then starting next Monday Bigger warm up comes in temperatures climbing back to near 80 degrees starting Monday and we'll probably hover around 80 degrees Tuesday and Wednesday. Plus, it will feel more muggy, definitely getting into that more spring like feel next week. So our weather pretty much stays quiet after that trough and that cold front passes through later today. Not much happening through the weekend and early next week, but then we track this next trough that's going to sweep throughout the country and that will provide our next cold front by the middle of next week and that will give us a chance to see some showers by next Wednesday and Thursday. So the month of February is flying by. We are going to be springing ahead and setting those clock clocks forward in just 17 days from now. The first day of spring is only 26 days away. Easter Sunday, 38 days away and hurricane season begins in 100 days. That is June 1st and we are just getting closer and closer. So here's a look at that seven day forecast as we close out the month of February temperatures in the 70s near 80 degrees next week. Beautiful, fantastic weekend, plenty of sunshine and then getting into next week. Our rain chances increase starting Wednesday. Alexa, thank you. We do